Now we're going to add these two like fractions. And when you add like fractions, you get a like fraction. So we keep the 12, don't we? And But we're going to combine the 3 and the 5 to give us what? 8. Okay. Now 8 and 12 have something in common. You may think you can divide them by 2, and you can. 2 goes into both of these. But there's a larger common factor. Now don't try 3, because 3 doesn't go into 8. So if you're not going to try 2 and 3, could you try 4? 8 divided by 4 is 2, and 12 divided by 4, let's do that first. 12 divided by 4 is 3, and 8 divided by 4 is 2. So final answer, 2 thirds.